You know, I was preparing my next accounting lesson, and uh, I've got my book over there to prepare my next accounting lesson. And they were talking about electronic cash registers. Now, when I was a kid growing up, electronic cash registers were basically this. Um, they would actually go ahead and send their data to a server, but when you were doing things with your electronic cash register, you could actually continue ringing people even if your server broke. Okay. Yes, the cash registers were technically connected to the servers, but they still operated semi-independently. So if the server went down, you could still ring on that cash register. And your sales could go on. Here's the problem. Most stores now have electronic cash registers that are really more computers than they are anything else. If the server goes down, they can't sell you anything. That's right, folks. If their server goes down, they can't sell you a thing. They don't have old-time cash registers which could keep receipt tape and and uh, whole nine yards and and uh, they continue on their business without any major interruption. They simply can't sell to you anymore. That's why I like these old-time farmers markets. Because let me tell you something: they do have electronic equipment, but if their equipment breaks, they can still sell it to you. They can still count change to you, believe it or not. They can write things down if they have to. But not many places in our society today. Cash register shuts you down, you're screwed. And let me tell you something. If you need emergency medical attention, that could be a big problem. No way to get the medicine to you. Like I said, Everything's all hooked up to one centralized server. It'd be, it'd be different if they had like three or four servers. If one of them went down, the other three would continue operation. But they don't have that anymore. So, I'd like to see more retail places develop a backup system that would be manual. Where, if things really did go down, they could continue selling and not have a problem. But they're not going to, unfortunately. And I'm sorry for that. Oh well. One of these days when the whole thing collapses, they'll know I said something. Hopefully, when you guys start building your own businesses, you will have a backup system just in case the big servers go. Who knows? Well, anyway, if you guys want to learn how to count change, I do have a video on my YouTube that will tell you how to count change. And if you want to know more from me, you can go ahead and leave me a comment down here below. I will tell you whatever I can. And uh, like I said, when you build up your own businesses, make sure you have cash registers that don't depend on a server. You can have ones that do, but also have ones that don't. That way, you can continue your business while your while your uh, competition can't. And let me tell you something: if you can continue your business while your competition can't continue their business, you'll be one step ahead of them. All right, I'll tell you more in a future video, so stay tuned.